Next, let's make this hook one. Let's call it that. Hook. Hook. So we have this shape. I'm going to I'm going to build this from the top view. Again, there's different ways that you could build this. I'm going to choose to build it from the top view looking down. So I'm going to start with top, sketch, and N, and P. So first thing, I really have a rectangle. So I'm going to make a rectangle like that. And now I'm going to use this sketch fillet command. I'm going to click on it. Now I could change this if I wanted to. If I double click on this, I could say I want it to be 1.2, right? Like that. <clears throat> and now the other ones will also be 1.2. Just like that. Return. Looks good. I'm still in sketch mode. Now I want to use this great tool called Offset. Now if I click on it and I click on any lines, I can select the lines, you see how it's creating an offset, or instead I'm going to click on this again, and I'm going to drag over all of this, and you see how it does an offset, and then I can just drag this offset out like that. All right, now I need a line, oh, somewhere in here. Again, these drawings, I'm not worried about dimensions, just making them look good. Uh, let's see, I want to hit escape, and another line over here, or I could hit the shortcut key L for line. And now the scissors. I'm going to clip this away and this away. Looks pretty good. Let's take a look at our drawing. I like it. Now I'm going to accept it. I'm going to zoom in, right click, extrude, or use the extrude button here. And that thickness eh, looks like it come up just a little bit. Okay, there we go. Now let's build this piece. To do that, Zoom in. I'm going to select this surface here. Right click, New Sketch. And now, N, to flatten it. P, and we can, well, yeah, P will get rid of that. Yeah. Um, and now I want to make a rectangle here. To do that, I'm going to touch off here and here. Watch what happens. Now it shows me where those two areas were. Let me show you that again. I hit escape. I'm going to go here. And I'm just going to touch these two points. And it will then, once I click, it will show me where that is. And I accept it. Zoom in a little bit. Select, right click. Extrude. Looks like this comes up a little ways. Maybe about like that. Click OK. All right, now let's round these edges off. I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to select both edges. I'm going to hit this fillet command right here. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. I'm going to grab this arrow. I'm going to bring it down just so I have a little bit of a flat spot on the top here. I mean, you could bring it in closer. It's fine. And there we go. Now lastly, I'm going to select this surface here, right click, new sketch, and you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this circle in, or this hole. So circle, I'm going to select the very center here if I zoom in a little bit, and I go down, little marching ants, I'm going to go down, oh, maybe, nope, this one gets a little tricky, go down about here, make my circle. And about like that. Click OK. I select that. Right click. Extrude. Remove. And I can drag it through or I can just say through all and click OK. And there it is. Our hook part. Looks pretty good.